Hey everyone, today I want to share three success secrets from the late Kobe Bryant, which were inspired by something that I read in the book, Raise Your Game. So in the book, Raise Your Game, if you haven't read it, highly recommend that you check it out. The author shares a story where he joined, he asked Kobe Bryant if he could join him in one of Kobe's morning practice sessions. And Kobe said yes, and he said, okay, well, I'll see you tomorrow at 4 a.m. So that's when he would start his practice sessions. Now this is you know, the greatest player in the game at the time, still getting up every day to practice at 4 a.m. ahead of everyone else. So the author joins Kobe that morning and watches him practice and um, is obviously super impressed by his you know, commitment to his schedule. And then he also notices that during the practice, Kobe, with, you know, Kobe's just practicing on his own, that Kobe is just doing the most basic offensive moves, the most basic drills, nothing advanced, just your basic footwork, basic shooting, uh, you know, layups, nothing too advanced, just the absolute most fundamentals. But he's doing them with laser-like precision and a high degree of energy. And he's just blown away though by what the routine is. It just wasn't what he was expecting at all. And he asked Kobe after he's finished his uh, pre-practice session. So Kobe was there actually practicing before everyone else would start practicing for the day. He was just practicing on his own, his own session. And he asked Kobe, why does the greatest player in the game need to practice such basic moves? And Kobe responds with a big smile. You know, he, Kobe always had that amazing smile. Um, he says, well, how do you think I became the best player in the game? And he ne didn't need to say, obviously, anything further from that. You know, the, uh, other than that, you know, the, the author, um, he understood in that moment. And there's three success secrets baked in there that I wanted to share today that we can all really learn from. You know, Kobe was such an amazing player, such an amazing person. And the three things that I gleaned from that story is if we want to achieve our fullest potential and whatever it is that we're doing, our business or our life, then we need to have a schedule. We need to commit to, you know, a practice. When is it that we're going to show up? What time? Try to make that the same time every day. And number two, after we have a schedule, when we show up, we need to show up at our best. Remember that Kobe was apparently doing these even very, very basic moves with like laser-like precision and a high degree of energy. So how do we show up at our best? You know, when we're on, how do we be intensely on and really, you know, give whatever it is our highest, most deliberate, most focused, you know, most genius attention and effort. And then number three, during that practice, Whatever it is that we're doing, whatever skill it is that we're trying to build or work on, we can never forget the fundamentals. We can never forget how important it is to do the basics. Um, I, you know, quick example with the videos that I do on YouTube. Um, this is going to be video 70 something and uh, I never had done videos before on YouTube. You know, I only started a few months ago actually. But I thought, okay, well, how do I get better at making videos? Well, I had to just stick to the basics of just keep filming videos. Just keep doing it over and over and over and over. So whatever it is for you, whatever skill you're trying to develop, if you're trying to be a writer, well, you need to write. You need to sit down and, and do the writing. If you want to be you know, better within your fitness uh, routine or for a particular sport, what are the basic drills that you can be practicing over and over and over to master those repetitions, master the skill sets, so that you have that very, very strong foundation from which you can operate from. So remember those three things from Kobe. We have a lot to, to thank Kobe for. You know, have a great, have a, sorry, have a set schedule. Um, show up with greatness. Show up at your best. And when you're in your practice session, remember to just distill things down to the most basic fundamentals and make sure that you're drilling those things over and over and over so that brick by brick, you can build the house of your success in your business or life. So I would love to hear from you in the comments below. How do you approach um, building you know, your success routine? How do you approach cultivating your greatness? 
You know, what are the things, your, 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 your steadfast things that, that, that you trust, that you rely upon? Share them in the comments below so that we can all learn. And please hit like and subscribe so that you never miss a future video. Thanks.